Right now, unraveling a murder for hire scheme in Hernando County after a 17 year old girl was gunned down on her doorstep. You're watching 10 Tampa Bay here at 530. I'm Josh Sidorowitz. And I'm Courtney Robinson. 10 Tampa Bay's Hannah Deneen spoke with investigators today who say that they have been working on this case for months. Hannah. This all stems back nine months to February 6th. That's when the Hernando County Sheriff's Office says a 17 year old girl and her mother came to their office to report that she had been sexually assaulted. The very next day, detectives say two men showed up on their doorstep and shot both the girl and her mother. The girl did not survive. The bullet that caused her death entered her lower left back area, suggesting that she was shot in the back as she was trying to run. Multiple agencies working to solve what they describe as a calculated murder of an innocent Brooksville girl. She was a good kid with a very bright future and to see her life cut short is heart wrenching to say the least. The shooting investigation immediately led detectives to 36 year old Leonard White, the man accused of sexually battering the girl. Detectives say they learned White offered 21 year old Sheldon Robinson $10,000 to kill the girl to prevent her speaking out on the sexual battery. Robinson posted this photo on social media, recruiting help for a quote cleanup job in exchange for $5,000 and cocaine. Detectives say 22 year old Keyshawn Woods answered that call. This murder was senseless a violent crime that must be answered for, and today is a huge step in that direction. The sheriff says that White and the victim knew each other prior to that sexual assault, but did not elaborate on their relationship. Now, in addition to these murder for hire charges, these men also face charges for witness tampering and disposing of evidence and more. If convicted on all counts, they face mandatory life in prison or the federal death penalty. In Hernando County, Hannah Deneen, 10 Tampa Bay.